I'm posting this video because I found a lack of information on these particular laser engravers. Um, they're not like the NEJE uh, machines in that uh, this has a, a real uh, uh, MKS DLC girdle board along with a 2.4 or 2.8, I haven't measured it yet, um, TFT touchscreen, all set up for CMC laser. I believe it's Gerbil 1.1. In any event, I just uh, wanted to post this for some caution out there. I uh, fired this thing up uh, after I assembled it, which wasn't too difficult at all. Uh, the very first thing I noticed was that the power connector had come loose from the laser and it wasn't crimped properly. So I pulled this apart, pulled the connector out, and redid the crimp connection and soldered it inside the uh, JST, micro JST connector. Um, so and everything was working pretty good. Well, I turned the machine back on and I was uh, using the uh, onboard uh, controls and I was going to focus the laser um, and uh, I turned it on noticed it wasn't working. So I accidentally bumped this cable here and the laser went into full power mode um, it shot uh, a hole through this uh, half millimeter uh, whatever the hell it is I'm not sure uh, anyway it went through this and obviously melted through that the uh, this rubberized foam here, pretty thick stuff went through the glass top and uh, see if you can get it. through the top of this walnut table through the glass and then out the side and that was in just a few seconds so <laughs> this is uh, damned powerful I it says 5500 uh, milliwatts on it come on baby uh, but I'm wondering if it isn't more than that. Anyway, what the hell? I won't focus. Anyway, so that's the video I'm posting just for information. And now there's some information on this uh, stump engraver.